M-O-R-R-I-S hyphen M-O-O-R-E. I'm 20 years old and I'm a member of this community. I'm also a leader and an organizer with Fearlessly and by the youth. We've been fighting the trauma center campaign for the past two years. We've been doing our best to raise awareness about the lack of trauma care on the South Side. We've been protesting at this hospital um, on a regularly for those past two years. We haven't received any collaboration from the hospital. We haven't received any negative, I mean, any positive responses from the hospital as far as what can be done about trauma care on the South Side. I want to urge the University of Chicago to think about the area that it's sitting in. This area is one of the highest populations of gun trauma and trauma period in the city. And there are massive hospitals that should be able to help these people that are suffering from these injuries. The city of Chicago is seeing high, high rates, and homicidal rates and things like that. And we can't help but think about what can these institutions do to help us make those rates come down. As a youth, I'm tired of seeing my friends die. I'm tired of seeing my friends bleed out. I'm tired of seeing youth on the ground with no help. That's a hard sight to see when you're 20, year, 20 years old and you're thinking about tomorrow and you're recognizing that tomorrow might not come for me. Um, I also want the university to begin to think about the economic violence that is causing a lot of the gun violence that we're starting to see in our community. It's not just because people are violent, people are suffering out here, people are destitute, people are poor, and they need help. And they need help from institutions like the University of Chicago. Last time that we came here, the University of Chicago Police Department was very violent with us, and it was unnecessary, but it's not gonna deter us. We're gonna continue to come back, we're gonna continue to fight, we're gonna continue to speak out about this cause because it's a voice that needs to be heard. Um, I'm grateful for everyone who is here, who has continued to support us through this fight. And now I would like to pass the opportunity to let Patrick, a university student, say his piece about how he feels. He's also someone who's been very, um, very supportive of this fight and had a lot. Yeah!